welcome to this special edition of Matador Express. I'm your host, Mike DuPont, and this week we're on location at Oklahoma Memorial Stadium where the Sooners just wrapped up their homecoming victory against the Red Raiders by a final score of 38-30 to in a game that saw many explosive plays. Here's what senior receiver Eric Ward had to say about Tech's ability to move the ball in a variety of ways. We got a lot of talented players. We got Jace, we got Bradley, Jakeem. I mean, it's a lot, it's too many to mention. We got the quarterbacks, and that's a very talented position right there in itself. We, got, we have a lot of talented players on this team. We just got to figure out how to go out there and execute the, execute the uh, opportunities that come to us. In last week's episode, we noted the keys to the game for the Red Raiders would be the ability to control the rushing attack and also win the time of possession battle. And the Sooners were able to control the clock for the most part in Norman, with 34 minutes of the game being controlled by the Sooners and 25 minutes to the Red Raiders. The Sooners outgained the Red Raiders on the ground 277 yards to 72 yards, so they roughly outgained the Red Raiders by 200 yards on the ground. Once again, Texas Tech saw two receivers go over 100 yards through the air for the Red Raiders. Eric Ward caught nine passes for 106 yards and two touchdowns. Here's what he had to say about his performance. Uh, the first one was a, um, it was a trick play, and I just act like I'm blocking the corner until he sees Kenny with the ball, and he, he a trigger trying to tackle Kenny, and I just slip off into the end zone, and it worked. And the second one was a double move because the corner kept biting on the out, the out routes we were running. And we, I just did a double move, and I was wide open as well. Junior Jason Morrow also caught eight passes for 116 yards, contributing to Tech's 388 yards through the air, but felt like the Red Raiders left a few opportunities out on the field. Here's what he had to say. You know, we came in here with a lot of confidence. I felt like, uh, you know, we did a good job uh, preparing well in practice. And, you know, like I said, we just had some uh, turnovers that just killed us and, and penalties. And, and, and that's just something that, you know, but the, the line's really young right now, and we have a freshman quarterback. I think that, you know, with the freshman quarterback and the new staff and everything, we've we've had you know more success than anyone could even imagine this season. And, and I just feel like we've done a great job so far. But you know, winning this game was our ultimate goal, and, and you know, we just have to get back on track next week. That wraps up this special edition episode of Matador Express for Ben Fox. I'm your host, Mike Dupont, and we'll see you next week, Raiderland.